Buenos dias, people. Today, I will be exposing Lovenox and some random sweaty Toxky girl. We will first start off with exposing Lovenox. People think that he's such a white knight, but really he is no more than a lowlife Discord e-boy. I'm not going to be exposing him for his fake hacker clutches as I have something even better, it's more juicy and it's gonna make him be destroyed. Lovenox will today go down as Simple Nox. That is right boys, Lovenox is no more than a little bitty simp bitty boy. I will be showing some of the DMs he had with Morgan, who as you may know from our previous video where we talked about Bommy's face getting leaked, um, Morgan is actually Bommy's best friend, or her best online friend, as they don't actually know each other IRL since they're antisocial, just like my best friend Zach. We're not best friends. I say that so he feels better about himself. Anyways, um, she is edited and emated because I'm not going to say the SEX word with several e boys ranging from Dream SP streamers to random better cheaters and even dog cat. What I'm talking about Morgan, by the way. Unfortunately for Love Knox, or as we will now call it Simple Knox, he was not able to actually edate her. He wasn't even on that level of as a person. She literally put him in a corner and made him do all of her Espanol La Terea. That's That means Spanish homework, guys. I used to take Spanish. I'm not actually Spanish, but I used to take Spanish for a little while. Then I dropped out because I got a bad grade. Maybe I need an evil in the clue not to do my homework, but I'm not actually gay, and I'm not a girl, and I will not be getting a gender change anytime soon because I am straighter than a line on a piece of paper that's curved. Poor Luvnox was literally getting friend zoned hard time by an e girl. They didn't even know each other in row. But of course, Lovenox made sure to always call Morgan adorbs or say, I love you, you look so good, you are so beautiful. And any other words like that, that just proves that he's a simp he would use. He'd be like, oh my god, you're so beautiful. Oh my god, hugs and kisses all around. Now, I know a lot of you will say, hey Charlie, couldn't Lovenox just be the gay best friend or a gay only friend? Well, while I have taken that into consideration, I have to say something. Um, Lovenox is actually straight, okay? I know a lot of streamers um, online are gay, but Lovenox is actually straight. He's not gay, guys. And I know this by him not saying he's gay. He's literally said he's straight before. And he complimented her pics in a non-gay way. This proves he actually isn't gay and that he was in fact forced to do her Spanish homework as a straight male. While Morgan just went out with her friends to get bubble tea or when she played better words, Lovenox wasn't even allowed in her Discord call. He was forced to go and do all of her Spanish homework to better her and worse than him. He had to do his own test. He was in school, but Morgan was like, no, I need to do my Spanish homework. Please do it. And he was like, I love you so much. I will completely do it for you. And we just go to sleep, Morgan. I will work on it when you're asleep. And then I'll send you all the answers later. No questions asked. I love you so much. And yeah, that's pretty much it for Love Knox. But I'm just making this video to tell Love Knox that if you ever need a straight friend, I know Doc at what's not actually straight, but if you ever need a straight male friend, I would love to fake a hacker clutch for you. I will give you content, man. Um, yeah, and I won't force you to do me la tarea de espanol. Yeah, I think I said it right. I haven't taken Spanish in a few years. With all this being said, we need to address another serious, very serious issue. I was casually queuing bedwars this night. Um, my favorite YouTuber, It's Fizzy, and my favorite OnlyFans person, Zypha Dlogus, when I randomly got into a pregame lobby uh, with some streamer who was unnicked and known as Gracefully Shy, I was on my ugly XX Rose account, which skin was inspired by one of you guys, one of my gracious fans, actually gave me the skin, and then Grace the streamer took it upon herself to insult me. She mocked me, she harassed me, she called me pathetic, and she sent her fans after me to insult me. I was so bored. Like, she had like 30 years of watching her stream, and one of her fans who actually um, went after me um, said, you're bad. However, he's a wrong corner of yours, so I was like, Aww, before the apostrophe are you, but he had already ignored me by then, so I was like, Frick, man, I couldn't really do a snark reply. And she just claimed she hates on, she claimed that she hates on people who hate on others, um, who don't do anything uh, wrong. Yet she literally so hated me. And I have never done anything wrong in my life. I have never stolen. Really I've never e dated. Really I've never been a simp. Um, I mean, have you seen the comments I get on the daily? Like, jeez, woman, w calm down. Shut the fuck I feel deeply hurt that she would attack a skin made by my fan and insult me and be such a hypocrite. Like, where does it end? She literally said she hates on people who hates on other people. Bro, I wasn't hating on anyone. I was literally not even going for her. I was just trying to go, go for um Fizzy and was like, and maybe my brother Zenby because I was going to boost him if I got into his game. But she just becomes a hypocrite. Like, what? Are you okay, dude? I mean, are you okay, lady? She later stated that she hates it more when people do it on female creators. So now is she just being straight up sexist? 
Oh yeah, did I mention that Zach, my boy who runs the channel with me, is literally bisexual? If that counts, so now she's just being homophobic for hating on us? Like, what? What? What, what, what is she on? I know she's not on drugs, because that would be illegal. People don't do drugs. Like, no one does. I have never heard of anyone doing drugs. I mean, personally, I did melatonin, but that's a over-the-counter thing. It just helps you sleep at night. It gives you very vivid dreams. So, like, I take it every night. It's really nice. But yeah. Um, anyways, she just really thought she could get away with being sex and homophobic. That basically ended up for the day. Oh, and Gracie, dear, if you're watching this, I hope you can become a better person like me and learn from your mistakes.